Today we're on a polishing project in Bethlehem and we are going to be grinding and polishing this floor to a 1500 grit diamond polish. This floor has previously been tiled and there's been black glue used to adhere the tile. You can see some of the outlines of the tile. It looks like an 8 inch square and the black glue that remains. There are also some cracks in the floor which we are going to be repairing also. So the first step we're going to be doing is coming in with a 25 grit diamond mounted on an HTC 800 grinder. This process is going to be totally dustless. We're going to come in, grind the floor one time, expose what's here, see what's here, and repair the cracks. So the next video clip you're going to see after we ground it to 25 grit diamond. We're about to start the first step, the first grinding process. Uh, that's going to be part of the entire polishing process of this concrete floor. Uh, we now have our vac system set up uh, to our grinder, our HTC 800 grinder, and this will then uh, start the process and we'll show you a little bit about what that looks like now. and then continue our grinding and polishing process. You most likely will see the cracks when we're done, however they will be flat, smooth, and polished like the rest of the floor. Okay, we did the first grind, which was 25 grit. We repaired all the cracks with epoxy, like we said, and then we ground the floor again with the 40 grit diamond afterwards. So now you can take a look at the cracks. You can see where they were. You can see the shadows of them. However, they were ground and they're smooth just like the rest of the floor. So now we're going to continue with an 80 grit diamond and continue all the way up to 1500 grit and hopefully this will reveal a beautiful floor underneath the black um, petroleum based glue that they had on there and the underlayment that was on top of it originally. Okay, so we grind the floor four times with a metal bond diamond. Uh, now we're going to apply a densifier to the concrete. It's important that you densify the concrete. As you grind the surface off, the surface gets weaker. Uh, it exposes the weak cement in, inside the floor. So we're going to apply the densifier and then we're going to continue with our resin bond diamonds. So this is just simply applying the densifier, some lithium silicate that penetrates in there and helps strengthen the concrete as you uh, continue your process. So that's going to bring out the final shine in the floor. If you look at the reflection over here, you're going to start to see a lot of reflection. This is 800 grit, real nice and smooth. We have one final pass yet. 
which is going to bring out the high gloss and make it pop. Okay, so we finished all of our grinding processes. We put the last coat of densifier and the glossing agent on. Now we're getting ready to burnish the floor. We're going to use the same grinder mounted with 1500 grit time reflection already underneath the grinder there. Okay, so we're all done. We ground the floor nine times. We burnished it. It's a 1500 grit polish. You can see the cracks that we had repaired. I mean, you can see where they were, but it's nice and smooth. Um, nice high gloss over the entire floor. You can see the reflection. And this is a, a, an extreme exposed aggregate, um, which is not necessarily what we were setting out to do, but this concrete was real soft, and we kind of took advantage of the situation and gave him an exposed aggregate floor.